Welcome to the NFC Championship presented by Intuit TurboTax Live and welcome back to New Orleans where the top seeded New Orleans Saints get set to take on the Los Angeles Rams. To the 25 it comes. You ready? Third down and eight. Breeze fires. Pass is caught. Ted Ginn and a first down. Breeze floats it. Pass. What a beauty. Camara with a first down. You're going to see John Franklin Myers is the one who has to drop because of the coverage. And all of a sudden he's locked up one on one with him. Camara and this. Just got it away. Breeze passes caught. Camara again. You ready? Breeze to the end zone. Pass is dropped by Arnold. Had it for a moment, couldn't secure it. Good protection pass is picked off the hands of Gurley and into the arms of Demario Davis. Well, David Onyemata, he's good. You're going to see the move that he makes and that he's able to get pressure on Jared Goff, which forces him to kind of come back on his heels and try to make a throw. But still with that, this is one that Gurley should catch a costly deflection. Ready. Ready. Set. Quick throw, Camara looking for blocks, doesn't get enough. Saints double their lead, but after the interception on the deflection. Third down and eight, Goff throws, pass incomplete for Woods. Your head coach Sean McVay and third year quarterback Jared Goff. Two possessions, no first downs for the Rams. Here's Hill with blocking. The tight end and a full head of steam inside L.A. territory. A catch and run of 24 yards. We're in a two deep shell, but a keep to leave here. You're going to see he plays soft because of the releases by the receivers. And as a result, they're able to just kick it out. And they run the screen pass, and he's got blockers out in front of him with nobody to block. And when you play the New Orleans Saints, you better be prepared for a variety of screens, whether it's to tight ends or running back. Ready? Breeze wide open Thomas and there's Peters trailing Thomas with a first down at the Rams 18 Breeze is on the sideline on third and four they run it and don't get it as Camara gets to the 10 that's it and we'll see what they drew him offside it appears Encroachment. Defense number 90. Now, the position of the goal results in the first down. And by that Rams defensive front and Brockers. Looking for line. Pass is caught for the touchdown by Garrett Griffin. Just added to the roster. Is a touchdown in the NFC Championship game. Yeah, Garrett Griffin, who was just brought up, you see they run the crossing action. The Rams run into each other. It frees up Griffin down on the goal line, and, and they are delivering. Quick throw to Woods. He needs some blocks. Doesn't get him. Anzalone finished him off. Will punt for the second time. Instead, he throws. Pass is caught for the first down. Well, you've always got to be aware of this when you play the Rams. He can throw the ball as well as most quarterbacks. And uh, what a good job by Sam Shields making somebody miss. But you, uh, convention is out the window when it comes to these two head coaches. And down 14-0 when he went for it. And the Rams being down 13, a good momentum shift. Goff will pick it up. He'll do what the Saints did, and that's finish that drive off with a touchdown. Goff passes strong and complete for a first down to the other tight end, Gerald Everett. Handoff is to Anderson. 
who has been the featured back, back draw, but not with golf. Third and six. Gurley dropped it, but a flag. 36-yard drive by Zerline. Drilled it. It's the first time Breeze has been hit in this game. Play clock. Was it one? Camara can't make the catch, and a big stop by this Rams defense. No look at it as Woods went to the ground, but here's a strong carry by C.J. Anderson. He is blitz. Rams pick it up. Pass is broken up. No flag. P.J. Williams in coverage on Josh Reynolds. That as well. Here's Kamara. Pass. What a strong catch for a first down as he's hit by Johnson. Kamara, five catches, 51 yards in this first half. Breeze in trouble. Down he goes. That's Sue. And Dominican Sue coming off his best game by a mile. Second down and 16. Breeze. Rockers in his face, and he's not alone. Sue again. It made big time plays. You could see the play clock was at zero. The Rams get a stop anyway. It's the longest pass completion at 12 yards. The Saints have done a great job of just getting players on the ground once they catch the football. Goff, Reynolds, first down, good throw. Good protection again, and the pass is caught for a big one. Goff floats. Cooks, what a throw! And Brandon Cook sets up first and goal. Here it is. Yeah, you look at the design. They, they motion Robert Woods down, and all of a sudden then that creates the matchup with P.J. Williams on Cooks. Brandon Cooks. They run it with Gurley. He spins for the touchdown. It's a dome silencer. We talk about momentum before the end of the half. On third down, good protection. Goff's arm was hit as he let it go, and incomplete for Woods. Overall, what they've done. Kamara out of the backfield. Littleton on him. Out of bounds with a first down. 46% of the time during the regular season. Fourth most in the league. And they run it here for a first down with Kamara. Defensive lineman barreling down on you. It was Ramchek out there, second team all pro. Here's Ingram busting free. To the 26. Patience today from Drew Brees. Here's the fullback line for a first down. It's the Saints in man. Here is Ingram setting up first and goal. So now third down and goal. Hill plows it in for the touchdown. He gets set and good blocking out front. Sean Payton was going to get Taysom Hill a touchdown. It was, it was going to be a touchdown pass or it was going to be a touchdown. Blitz. Rams pick it up. Pass is caught for a first down by Cooks. Communicate that as hard. Play action, it's what the Rams do best. The pass is a beauty to the sideline caught by Brandon Cooks. Play action again, Cooks wide open. Brandon Cooks with some extra yards after the catch and a big play. Up the field, that gets the corner out of there and then you see that's why there, there's just no deep third coverage once Cooks is able to come across and catch that shallow flat route. Here's Reynolds. Reynolds down near the goal line and short, but first and goal. Down and goal. Quick snap. Play action. Wide open. Touchdown. That's Higby. And the tight end left alone. Well, Alex Anzalone, he's the one in man coverage on Higby. And you're going to see he's got his eyes in the backfield, and then by the time he realizes that golf has it off play action, he just can't get out there to cover him. So, and Super Bowl 44 MVP from the 25, leading by three to the sideline, wide open. Traquan Smith. 
against the Eagles last week. 12 for 171. Here's Ingram with a first down to midfield. Right here, expect him. That's Fowler off the edge. Breeze throws, a lot of contact. No flag. Mikel Roby Coleman was there defending, and it was Ted Ginn, the target. And let's look at this again. It definitely was looked to me like a hold. It didn't look like he was allowing him to come out of the break. He wanted to try to work back towards the boundary. Well, I, I think it's interference. I think the ball is out of his hands. He breaks to the outside, but you can see he makes contact clearly before the ball arrives. It is contact that keeps him from making the catch. I really do believe that is pass interference. Second down and seven. Goff keeps under pressure. Jordan got it. Here on third and 15. So careful they just hand it off. And C.J. Anderson gets back to the line of scrimmage. That's it. Just trying to keep everything in front of him. Come up and rally to the football. Third and 17, and the pass nearly picked. Ginn was the target. Goff out to his right. Throws, and the pass is caught for a first down and more. That's Everett. Gerald Everett takes it into Saints territory. Play action, Goff throws, pass to Reynolds. Spinning catch out of bounds inside the 10. Be a lot of guts again this week. Quick snap. C.J. Anderson. He is going to be Mark Short. Got it. Breeze with all day flips it to Camara. First down and stays in bounds. Breeze airs it out. Ginn downfield. He's got it. First down inside the 15. At the two minute warning. Well, LaMarcus Joyner, the safety, he sees this all the way and he's in a great position. But you see, he goes up, he doesn't get his hands up over his head. If he goes up with his hands above his head, he can knock the ball down. Instead, he acts like he's trying to just catch it in his chest as though he's the only guy trying to make a play. Good point on third and 10. Quick snap. Breeze. Pass is incomplete. No flag for Tommy Lee Lewis. Mikel Roby Coleman delivered a hit. And the two officials talk to each other. Crowd's going crazy as there's no flag right on the Saints sideline. Well, if Mikel Roby Coleman plays the ball, it's an interception. It's probably going the other way with it. I mean, the ball's on the other side of Roby Coleman. and But that should have been a penalty. And, you, and John Payton is, is justifiably upset. Mike Pereira, if that was a penalty, that would have, in essence, ended the game. Did you think it was a penalty? Yeah, I really do. I know it's easy in slow motion. They're close to bang, bang, but that was early enough, even high contact on the receiver. So you really could have had a foul either way. This for the lead. 31-yard try is good. But after the 43-yarder, the Saints throw an incompletion, run it for no gain, and then this, and clearly contact before the ball got there. Yeah, he, he had... I mean, it, he, all he was doing was was staring down Lewis and just playing the man and never got turned on. I mean, it's, it's, it can't be any more obvious than that. Yeah, I mean, Sean Payton, he just simply cannot believe it, nor can anyone that's in the in the stadium watching this. If a flag is thrown there, the Saints have the ability to run the clock down to four seconds left and end the game with a field goal try, a chip shot. Goff throws, pass, caught. That's Reynolds. And Reynolds is able to spin his way out across the 40. Pass is caught by Woods. Just got it away. Pass is incomplete.
The kick is good. Sirline clutch, and with 15 seconds left. He's still the visitor. He's called heads. It is tails. You want the ball. It's way. You got it. Mike. We're waiting. Second. Second and ten. Breeze down the middle. Receiver stumbled. That was Arnold. And now a flag comes in. That's an appearance. Defense number 26. Flat foul. Automatic first down. Breeze, protection breaks down, ball is up for grabs and caught, picked off by John Johnson. That ball hit at the line of scrimmage and John Johnson on his back. John Johnson's on his back, he falls down after the contact and is able to make a play as he's fallen down. They hadn't been able to create a takeaway the entire game, it's what they've kind of lived on defensively throughout this year. It's a heck of a play by Dante Fowler as well as John Johnson. Starting field position of the game. Goff under pressure. Pass is caught by Higby. And Tyler Higby with a first down brought down by Von Bell. Just simply cannot take a sack. Safe throw. Cooks drops it. Ball 53. Bad snap. The kick is good. Rams win it and on to Super Bowl 53 they go.